it off the forehead of the boy in my mirror. You comforted me when nights turned sour. I was the hunchbacked sinner hiding atop the bell tower. You wiped away my tears and the lines the other children drew on my face. You said mine was a soul too sentimental for this world. I found comfort in the crevices of your words, so I watched silence as you curled and bled beneath my door. You rendered my arm a tragic tapestry of those you knew before, and now there's blood upon the floor. Most mornings, you leave me with the bad taste of dreaming. My mother's asking why I'm smiling when I'm grieving, but I don't reply. See, with you, with you, I've long grown accustomed to watching silence solidify. Looked for comfort in your lie that a quiet heart is free of grief. Surely, surely you knew the bitter fruit that lie was bequeath. As tongue grows still and heavy with its burden. For words always taste overripe when they fall from these lips. And for now I let that taste linger, but... I heard you were the tension in Kurt Cobain's trigger finger. You say you're a victim too. But you're the lead in a bullet that longs to be a poet's pencil. So I sit and fidget with this pen, but only end up at your door again. You invite me in and remark how the sky is so dismissive of a soul's distress. As evening slips out of her party dress, night comes too quickly and awkwardly hugs the horizon. Together we listen to the dew fall. Listen to that wet silence settle and set. Moonlight enters undressed and glistening, finds me hunchbacked and shivering. The moon mistook my heart strings for harp strings and played a gentle melody as falling leaves waltzed like sad lovers, struck by their own fragility. <laughs> 